Call Lo, Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. Shalom to the house of David, the 144,000, the church of the saints, the one third men, women, and children are part of the elect. For the 12 tribes of Israel, who tell you blacks, Latino, Native Americans. Is he gonna have to play this clip? This shit is funny as hell, man. I had to play this clip. Showing you even the mainstream media, <laughs> the, the, um, the, the staff, <laughs> the mainstream media staff is even fucking sad that uh, Hillary Clinton's winning. I'm gonna play this clip. It's funny as hell, man. I have to play it. Kind of close. It's sort of a nail biter. But what I'd like to talk about today is how mainstream media is shitting their pants. Their yesterday polls were a joke. And now they have to get out in front of 300 million Americans and explain what in the hell went wrong with their poll numbers. The American people know that the polls were a fraud, were made up. They know that. American people know that mainstream media is trying to brainwash them. But now, what I like to look at is how mainstream media has to get out in front of all these Americans and explain this to America. How Donald Trump is winning and our poll numbers were shit. They're not doing a very good job of it. And their body language is really, really pathetic. If you've watched this, if you haven't watched mainstream media tonight, then you probably ought to go just watch their body language. Turn the volume down. Don't listen to their bullshit. Just watch their head hanging down, their solemn look. They are so disappointed that oh, Donald good. Trump is winning that their mainstream... Yo, very good. Very good. finished, man. <laughs> America's done, yo. It's done. You guys, you gotta see this. You gotta laugh. Yeah, I was laughing my ass off, man. Media brainwashing didn't work, <laughs> and now they know that mainstream media is dying. That's what we're gonna look at today. We're gonna look at the body language of these mainstream media shills as they have to come out in front of America and explain why their poll numbers were a joke. Look at this guy. This guy is visibly disappointed. Look at that. Look at them. They can try to hide it. They shake their head in disgust. They lower their head. They're shaking their head. The only thing I get from these mainstream that's media... That's Esau. Esau's upset because that's it. It's done, man. Here it is. The stock market went down 750 points. Come on, man. The shills today, these talking heads, is a solemn look. Look how solemn and depressed they look. <laughs> this is what the Hillary Clinton is losing, and that's the look they have on their face it is scary. Let's continue. Look at these guys. They got their head down. I mean, they are visibly depressed. They knew. These guys knew that Hillary Clinton was going to win without a doubt. Now, here they're going to they call up their poll expert. He's sitting in the back. There he is. Shaking. Oh, my God. Now, these two young people <laughs> on the left, they're in shock because now they're going to listen to the poll expert. And here the poll expert is going to tell them. Uh, here's the here he is, the poet. He's going to tell everybody how our poll numbers were so wrong. He tries to explain, oh, I guess the American people are angrier than we thought. And those two young people on the left are just looking like, damn, this guy doesn't know shit. He's been lying to us. <laughs> the young people are waking up today and saying, wow, these old people have been lying to us. They've been making up the poll numbers. I mean, they, the body language is, is there. Look at these people. They are so depressed. I and uh, they're bringing out some of the old timers, and um, I tell you, that's probably the most enjoyment I get out of tonight's election is how depressed these mainstream media shills are. They knew in their bottom of their heart, they knew Hillary Clinton was going to win easily, and then Donald Trump comes pulls out ahead first. I'm not going to say Donald Trump's going to win. It you know it's a close one. It's a close one, but. Just the body language of these assholes who've been trying to brainwash America for months and months telling us only Hillary can win. Donald Trump cannot win. And now look at him. Look at this guy. He's the worst of the bunch. This guy here, uh, what's his name, Todd or something? He's the worst of the worst. Look at him. How the, he looks like he's going to cry here. He literally thinks he's going to cry, this guy. And then, you know, this guy been around too long i guess but he's uh he's visibly depressed isn't he look at look at them there they're look at they're in shock if these guys are in shock that hillary clinton is losing 
Wow. Let me see if I can't find some more clips. Okay, one more. Here's the mainstream media show as she's reporting that Florida is probably going to Donald Trump. Look at her. I mean, she's just not very happy that Florida is going to, to Trump. You know what happens if Florida goes to Trump? Well, all these, <laughs> all these Hillary supporters are going to be really, really disappointed. Okay, well, I'll try to find oh, some other clips of the mainstream media oh, show so when they're disappointed and crying like this guy. But uh, I'll leave you with this. Donald Trump only needs 38 more to win. And he has 232 at the close of this video. Hillary Clinton has 209. So Donald Trump is still ahead unless they do something with the electronic voting machines. Donald Trump, Trump looks like he's about ready to win. And if Donald Trump w does win, I'll try to show you some more body language of mainstream media shills as they lower their head in disgust as they tried to brainwash America with the fake polls. I'm sorry, that shit, that shit was funny as hell, man. That is R.I.P. to America, man. It's, it's done, it's finished. <laughs> like she wanna cry. But, but, uh, hey, that's the spirit of the Lord, man. You about to destroy this place. That's spiritual. Because Trump being president, whether it's Hillary or Trump, it's like Trump's gonna win. Yo, it's over, man. That's the spirit. He was shaking their heads down. The, 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 the stock market crashed at 750 points. Wait till tomorrow morning, man. Hmm. World of the world markets, man. People panicking. So, man, we at the end of this bitch, yo. Isaiah 13 and 6. How ye, for the day of the Lord is at hand. It shall come as a destruction for the Almighty. Therefore, <laughs> he shall come to destruction from the Almighty. Therefore shall all hands be faint and every man's heart shall melt. And they shall be afraid. Pains and sorrow shall take hold of them. They shall be in pain as a woman that travail of. They shall be they shall be amazed one at another. Their faces shall be as flames. That's what you Edomites too, man. One of you Edomites, you red ass Edomites, man. You gonna be you gonna be in, when you see America going down, your face is gonna turn red as hell, man. <laughs> they shall be amazed one at another. Let me read that again. Isaiah thirteen and eight, and they shall be afraid. Pains and sorrow shall take hold of them. They shall be in pain as a woman that travaileth, like a woman giving birth. They shall be amazed one at another. Their faces shall be as flames. <laughs> They're amazed. <laughs> you know, the scriptures are bad. They shall be amazed one at another. They're amazed right now. Their faces shall be as flames. Behold, the day of the Lord cometh cruel with both wrath and fierce anger. To lay the land desolate, and he shall destroy the sinners thereof out of it. For the stars of the heaven and the constellation thereof shall not give their light. The sun shall be darkened and is going forth, and the moon shall not cause a light to shine. That's going into your wisdom, knowledge, your understanding, man. All the so-called knowledge that you have, Esau, is going to be brought to naught, man. All that witchcraft and sorcery you go doing to Isaiah 47 and 12. Most likely going to deal with you devils, man. He's dealing with you now. You all messed up now over this Trump thing. Wait till you go in slavery, man. The last trumpet. And America be destroyed. And I will punish the world for their evil and the wicked for their iniquity. And I will cause the arrogancy of the proud to cease. And I will lay low the haughtiness of the terrible. <laughs> this is beautiful, man. This is beautiful. They shall be amazed one at another. Oh, man. This is too funny. This is too funny, man. Call all you have by Shem Yahushai. Shalom to the house of David. 144,000 church of the saints and the one third. Men, women, and children part of the elect. We almost out this fucking bitch. It's our time to rise, man. Time for you devils to be in sorrow and pain. Shalom.